Konnichiwa! Hi, I'm Kiran Jessel and this is a special episode of Makan Minum Kopi. Today we're here at Zero Sushi for lunch, so come and follow me. incredibly excited to have my first proper Japanese meal in a full-on Japanese restaurant. I can't wait, so... Arigato! Ooh, looks good! So this is my starters, and as you can see, I have three dishes on my plate. So this is kakiage, or well, it's known in uh, Malaysia as tempura. So it's basically shrimp and vegetable fried together. In the middle, I have fish liver from Anko fish, better known in Malaysia as goose fish. So in the last one here, I have a shellfish known as Saza A. Shall we get started? There's onions, I think a bit of carrot. It's really nice, it's really crunchy. And I'm one person, I quite like prawns a lot. And you can taste how fresh the prawns are. It's really good. It tastes really good. It doesn't taste fishy at all. It's very smooth, you know, on the palate. It's actually surprisingly really good. Whoa, that was a mouthful indeed. You can really taste the crunchiness and the texture of it. It's so fresh, fresh from the sea. So this is egg. We have crab meat over here. Here's the fish roll. Here it's very famous, you know, it's the most basic of sushi. We have one side with cucumber and the other side with tuna. This is picket ginger. This is salmon. So we have shrimp right here, otherwise known as abi. Then we have a fish called amber jack. Over here we have the tuna back and the tuna belly. It actually tastes like tofu a little bit. Mm, very soft, a little bit sweet. I'm just gonna pour a little bit of soy onto my sushi. So in Malaysia, we usually pour it on a saucer, and we have, and we mix the wasabi inside. We kacau kacau, and then we eat. But that's not how we do it in Japan. I just found out that if you do that here, it's really bad form. It's a complete no no. So you take your soy and you just put it a bit and then you take your wasabi and you have it. You do not mix it at all. <laughs> it's really fresh. Now onto my most favorite part of the plate, salmon. It's so good. I remember in the Philippines, Miss USA and I used to have raw salmon all the time. Every morning for breakfast, for lunch and for dinner. That's how much I love raw salmon. Mm. That prawn was so fresh. It was as if like the chef just went to the market and like picked it up. It was that fresh. That was a great sushi platter and now I can't wait for my favourite part of the day or rather the meal, my tempura plate. Oh, oh my god. So I'm going to try this first. So I have a prawn right here and I have sweet potato and some other fried vegetables. So I'm just going to go and give that a try first. I love, love, love prawn tempura. So crunchy, so fresh. I think this is the best tempura I've ever had in my life. <sighs> I'm so full and I absolutely love the food that I had. 
Oh my god, a sashimi platter? You always have room for more when you're in Japan. Great meal here at Zuru Sushi for an episode of Makan Minum Coffee here in Japan. Thank you so much, Aligato and Sayonara!